हाय एवरीवन प्रीति मैम आर वी ऑन गुड आफ्टरनून सर गुड आफ्टरनून यू कैन जस्ट वेट फॉर अ मिनट और टू सर एंड देन बिगिन सम पार्टिसिपेंट्स आर स्टिल जॉइनिंग ओके ओके नो इश्यूज गुड मॉर्निंग गुड आफ्टरनून टू बी प्रसाइज गुड आफ्टरनून सर शिखा मैम एंड रुद्र बुराडे इफ यू पीपल वॉन्ट टू यू हैव रेज हैंड्स इफ यू पीपल वॉन्ट टू से समथिंग प्लीज राइट इन द चैट बॉक्स we can start sir hi everyone uh technology has changed a lot of things this is such a convenient way of addressing all of you together at different locations uh i have my team members Preeti Tyagi, ma'am, Prashant sir, Sandhya, who will be <coughs> addressing different sections and who will be answering your questions of different nature. I am Praveen Tyagi. I am a B.Tech from IIT Delhi, and this seminar I am informed is mainly about parents whose kids are planning to join us for their further journey. So. i will be addressing mostly the parents today children who are a part of this seminar will also have something to learn gain from so let me start with the so in this journey of 24 years the 25th year is on this year there are a lot of things that i have learned and when you keep doing something for so many years you develop some expertise some insights which can help others and that is why i am here in front of you today uh once i have uh, summarized what i have to say then i will be open for questions from all of you so till then please be patient and if anything comes to your mind you want to ask you can keep writing that in the chat box which will help us in answering your questions in a organized way so dear parents i have learned that there are many things that are on the mind of a parent when the child starts dreaming about competitive exams like iit or neet and lot of questions queries information is bombarded from different channels today is the world of social media and uh, i would like to utilize this opportunity to share whatever i have learned from my own path as a student as a teacher which 
will specifically help the parents to handle this phase of their child's life. So it will be more generic. So let me begin with my journey. So my father was a farmer. We were nine brothers, sisters. I am the eldest son. And my father, somewhere he heard, he understood that education is something which can change lives. So he was himself a pehlwan and wrestler professional. And he was like, Mujhe apne bacche padhane. So he did a lot of interesting things like how he got me admitted into a good school is a very interesting uh, mechanism of many months hard work and he used all his energy and uh, intelligence in getting me admitted to a reputed school which was a very big challenge for an uneducated farmer but i will talk about the relevant stuff so there was a day when many of my relatives when i reached ninth i used to study in delhi public school ghaziabad and uh, which was near my village and one day many of my relatives gathered and they were trying to convince my dad that isko take him out from the school and use him in farming he is your eldest son strong enough now to do farming and we will help you a little bit so getting you the equipment and the initial seed cost you may call it and uh, if he is involved into farming and you will save the money that you are spending on his school education so your times will change you will be able to survive we were like in a very bad shape at that time financially so because my future was being discussed i was listening attentively so the answer to that question given by my father was a turning point in my life his answer was ke mujhe isko sirf tak. so some of the relatives were telling him ke, what will he do after 12th even if he studies in this school till 12th so my father had no clue about competitive exams he just answered that in hindi ke main iski neev majboot karna chahta I just want to strengthen his fundamentals, concepts, I mean uh, fundamentals that he should get decent education, learn proper English and study in a good school till 12th. Uske baad, he can be like a clerk or a sub-inspector. This is the maximum he could think. So this was his approach when he decided to continue my education despite all challenges. The output of this approach was that three of my brothers are IITians, one is an IPS officer in UP Garder. And I realized that education became the transformative thing for our family. And hence, when I was in IIT teaching, became a popular teacher, I decided to teach. I used to love teaching, I used to enjoy teaching and I saw that what it can do to a family, to a child. So I was like very sure, very clear in my IIT days also. Became a celebrity teacher then then uh, while teaching, I that same fundamental iski foundation majboot karni hai, iski foundation ko strong karna chata hon by sending him to the good school. I focused on everything with the same approach. So while it was running pace, why we have been like a market leader in last 24 years and uh, been consistently attracting our colleges, junior science colleges, they have the highest cutoff every year. Our students are doing so well in competitive exams year after year, consistency. Uh, and the reputation, the respect that we get from every corner, I mean, if you talk about IIT campus, so I have like IIT Mumbai has hostels filled with pay students. Most of my students, they prefer to join IIT Bombay. Uh, the director of IIT Bombay, the dean of IIT Bombay, Mr. Gopalan, their kids got selected in IIT through PACE. Or you go to Mantralya the ps2 cm the chief secretary the ps2 fadnavis ji at the moment 
all three their kids went to iit from pace b go to police you go to a doctor you go to i mean in every walks of life i have people whose children have achieved success at pace and all this was achieved by keeping the fundamentals right what do i mean by that so when i will run the show and i will uh, uh, manage things i was very clear that it will not be run by the ego or decision making of praveen tyagi it will be run by the child centric approach any decision that you take should be in the interest of the children whom for whom this whole ecosystem is made for feedback driven mechanism the children their feedback on a daily basis is extremely important and the moment you feel that there is a slack in your system in your teaching mechanism in your administrative mechanism in every nook and corner i took fundamentally right decisions for example at a time when many other people will hire marketing executives with mba degrees i will go for mothers whose children have been uh who have studied in pace done really well and who understand my system and who have a very motherly attitude towards children so they were the caretakers they are the people who are running the show at all my centers so this fundamentally right approach of doing things for example when i realize that in other places children are having an advantage Uh, uh where they bunk the schools and colleges and in mumbai the child is traveling to coaching class and then going to a junior science college so he spends first going to junior science college spending 6 hours there and then traveling to a coaching class so i realized that the child in mumbai was wasting a lot of time so i decided to go ahead with the, an integrated approach which became a trend across the country we collaborated with podar schools long back 15 years back uh 15 16 years back uh where we uh, uh started teaching the child within the school hours by pace teachers which saved the time of the child and uh, increased his productivity and saved a lot of self study time for the child or be it uh, so any decision any innovation that we did it was all always originating and centered around the child and because when you start understanding the needs of the child uh you actually uh, deliver i'll give you an example i learned from there was a coaching classes called agarwal coaching classes and when i was a child in my village i prescribed to their notes uh, study material correspondence course and they will very diligently mark every line with a red pen and uh, correct the papers and send them back through the post to you in your village and you felt so connected you learned so much because of their due diligence they made you work hard they they had told ke we will send this in installments we will uh, share one fourth of the portion first with you once you have corrected completed those booklets then we'll send the next one fourth so all that made me work hard uh, thinking that if i will not do these chapters i will lose that money so they and then they will correct the papers very properly and that brand is respected till date uh, uh, we recently had a iit delhi alumnus get together and we were all fondly talking about agarwals and i was like ke bhai it is it doesn't exist anymore but uh, i have learned a lot of things and i have tried to inculcate those principles those things into my system so when you do right and fundamentally right things you are bound to be a success story despite the fact that lot of people uh, do a lot of marketing and everything and pace has been like not at all uh, too much into marketing i mean very matlab there is not even a single person there is no marketing department in pace will you believe this in last 24 years 
there is preeti ma'am there is praveen tyagi there is kuldeep tyagi who sometimes decide some student will come up that i will put up some hoarding someone will come up ke give an ad that's it these are the two three activities which we know and we keep doing that this hoarding thing also one of my student uh, he runs the show and he came and offered me ke let me do it that's why we did it otherwise with this minimal thing there is a uh, that goodwill that respect that we have earned by doing the right things uh, which is uh, making us succeed and roaring now let me come to the parents whose children have got into this process they need to understand the ecosystem of the child properly with a different perspective so you know your child as your child you know that he goes to school and you are also uh knowing aware that you will admit him in a coaching class these are the three components that you know but my learnings teach me that <clears throat> my first batch itself i had so the role of friends in your child's life so in my first batch itself two year course i had this parag vibhor mihir three friends traveling on a cycle atomic energy school number 4 brc chembur uh डाउन द हिल एक आगे बैठा है एक पीछे एक ड्राइव कर रहा है ब्रेक्स फेल हो गए हैं गिर गए हैं हाथ पैर छिल गए हैं इस तरह की दोस्ती बॉन्डिंग दे यूज टू स्टडी टूगेदर आई यूज टू टेल दम तुम तीनों की रैंक टॉप हंड्रेड में आएगी एंड दे वेरी गुड फ्रेंड्स दे विल डिस्कस द सब्जेक्ट दे विल डिस्कस देयर डाउट्स विद द टीचर्स विद अमोंग्स दम सेल्व 67 69 and 76 were their ranks parag agarwal was the first gold medalist i had in international physics olympiad and he is now ceo twitter next batch i had yashodhan kanoria and aditya parmeshwaran i can give you n number of examples where i have seen so good students they always get good friends their company i think wo bolte hai na society makes a man so it actually plays a very important role i reached iit because of a very close friend of mine pankaj singh in school he used to always tell me stories about iit how once you get selected your life is made then he used to give me his notes then he will tell me when i'll get stuck somewhere he'll tell me what approach should i use uh, so that friend played a role which no one else could not even my father not even my school not no one <clears throat> he once said tyagi tere mein brain bahut zyada hai but tu padhta nahi hai initially i was insincere beginning of 11th so tu zyada padhta nahi hai but if you start working hard you have a better brain than me now this is friendship now instilling that confidence in me at a time when everyone was ahead of me in school only a friend can do that so i will want you to become a little more aware of this component of your child's ecosystem that his friends are going to play a very important role in his life and please ensure that you play a catalyst you play the role of a catalyst or you ensure or you guide by ensuring that your child has good friends so a little effort has to go there conscious subconscious little uh, uh, verbal whatever way just instill this thing in your child's mind that he must choose his friends carefully because i have seen friends hum school mein saat log the dps gazeyad mein and all seven got selected in iit so this is the impact your friends have the communication he has in fact when a child earlier i used to face this problem but when we started our own junior science colleges another advantage that our colleges have is that they attract all the brightest students of different schools and because of that the environment in pace colleges and uh, classes wo sab bacche ko that, that does, the friends that he makes Uh, are generally sincere students but in your building and other ecosystem you have to be a little cautious careful and vigilant that's one 
uh, thing that I want to you to understand. There is another thing that why does a child? So this is the third thing. Why does a child want to win a gold medal in school race? Why does he want to come first in class? That gold medal is actually not made of gold. All the children know it after one or two years in school. Why does he want to come first? What is his motivation? Where is he deriving that purpose? In sixth class, in seventh class, in eighth class, in ninth class, he is not going to get selected in IIT also, but still he wants to come first and works sincerely, works hard. What is that motivation? And that motivation is what I've realized is emotional motivation. So, Pitaji ne ek bar, mein bagal mein lita hua tha, aur mere se kaha ke, bhai tu, और कुछ करिए या मत करिए एक बार आईआईटी में आके दिखा दे दिस इज लाइक टिपिकल हिंदी आई एम स्पीकिंग ऑन इस बिहार कि एक बार जस्ट वंस गेट सिलेक्टेड इन दिस एग्जाम आई डू नॉट वांट एनीथिंग एल्स फ्रॉम यू दैट वन लाइन आई हैड नो आइडिया व्हाट विल हैपन आफ्टर आईआईटी वाज स्टेइंग इन अ विलेज नो क्लू अबाउट एनीथिंग एंड आई हैव सीन सो मेनी स्टूडेंट्स देयर इज दिस बॉय आफ्टर 11th ही कम्स टू मी and he starts uh, i am getting into my car after my lecture he comes to me and i just want to refrain from names because they are all placed very highly and these are personal matters and he had uh, he uh, was in pace and he comes to me after his 11th i am getting into the car and he comes to me and tells me i want to talk to you i said yes sure he says uh, i have are you aware i have lost my dad maine kaha sorry to hear that but i am not aware then he shared that it was his dad's dream to for him to get into iit and he has not been studying very hard and been insincere uh, wasted a lot of time all that i was like ke bhai thoda sa use motivational talk aadhe ghante ki humne baat baat ki he said i am ready to do anything and he got so sincere 200 something rank in iit kalpit dikshit was his name यहीं कहीं अंधेरी विले पार्ले के आसपास रहता है नाउ इज इन अमेजन इन आर्टिफिशियल इंटेलिजेंस डिट इज एम एस फ्रॉम स्टैंडफोर्ड एंड नाउ ही इज इन अमेजन वॉट आई एम सेंग इज सो मैनी सच स्टोरीज आई हैव सीन दैट इफ अ चाइल्ड विल वंस डिसाइड इन इज माइंड इन इज हार्ट and he derives this connect this emotional motivation from parents if it is a routine thing if it is a normal thing like aap aap usko paise se motivate nahi kar sakte hain aap usko kitna bright career hoga kitna he will be able to earn all that will not motivate a child as much as these emotions do so having those heart to heart community which generally parents have but what i want to tell you is that you need to understand that this is what is the most important thing that works with kids this emotional motivation that he derives from you i will tell you i have used this component as a big thing in one of the innovations that i have done which we are starting from this year and it has got ready now i'll share that with you let me in fact do that right now so parental role that emotional motivation proper guidance plays a very very important role so you need to be aware that joining our classes and paying the fee and writing the check is not enough you need to be a little participative you need to wo jo constant motivation hai i'll tell you how how a child gets affected and how he derives uh, strength from such inspirations so there was this child in a classroom i opened the door of that classroom people were checking their mark sheets answer sheets subjective paper hua karta tha so i just uh, he sitting on the front batch his name was nikhil uda i take his paper i see his marks are not great i tell him are sirf ek line boli maine are main to sochta tha yaar you are a very sincere student and i returned his paper one and a half year later when the results came he was rank 34 or 43 in india in iit after the result when he met me then he said ke sir that one line of yours made me start working hard 
so many such incidents so when a child is emotionally connected to someone or respect someone a lot he derives a lot of inspiration and especially from parents this is what i want you to understand it will help you in grooming your children handling them age force pushing all the time cribbing about padle 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 outdated it doesn't work in this generation it doesn't work for sure you cannot push a child you can't force a child you should not be doing any kind of pressure on the child it will be counterproductive let it be a child's if you have to say something say it in an emotional way communicate that it maybe it's not like you shouldn't say or tell your child that you want to see him in iit that's not wrong but insisting or pushing or all the time nagging about it is wrong so that is there has to be a fine line there then there is this uh, uh important innovation which i said ki the parental participation that i was so i have been like in my whole journey i have been uh, always thinking how i can improvise my pedagogy my system more and more and make it better for the students to learn so let me show you my latest innovation that we have uh, got ready and uh, you will be parents will be extremely happy and this is for this innovation is done keeping in mind parental participation i wanted parents to be on a daily basis aware i'll tell you how it works so let me show you girish are you there yes sir so there is an app that we have created which is called step app and step app is student talent enhancement program it's a gamified way of learning maths and science concepts and only the concepts we are not making the child do numericals and all but we are clearing his concepts of the chapter using this app and have a look the uh, look at the app and then you will understand what i'm talking about and i'll come to the part so i have seen as a teacher i've learned every small small thing so when a child is sitting in class there are moments or seeing a video lecture there are moments when he gets distracted the moment he gets distracted starts talking to his friend and the teacher is speaking something the moment that chain breaks of thoughts or understanding the concept the child starts missing concepts the moment that missing of concepts happen there is a discontinuity in his learning and understanding so this is a big catch if you want to keep the child motivated if you want to keep him on toes if you want to keep him accountable on a daily basis now every parent wanted k मेरे बच्चे को कोई रोज मॉनिटर करे और मुझे पता हो देखिए ड्रीम सिचुएशन बताता हूं कैन समवन ऑन अ डेली बेसिस टेल यू एवरी वीकनेस एंड एवरी स्ट्रेंथ ऑफ योर चाइल्ड द मोमेंट ही फिनिशेस अ चैप्टर कैन यू गेट अ रिपोर्ट हाउ मच अंडरस्टैंडिंग ही इज गॉड ऑफ दैट चैप्टर द मोमेंट योर चाइल्ड मेक सम मिस्टेक्स देर शुड बी समवन हु शुड tell him and explain to him the concept on which because of which he is making the mistake when your child is weak in certain area and you get that feedback on your email and your phone you will be able to approach the pace teachers you will be able to sit with him and guide him in that sub topic but you need to be aware of that the moment your child will know Okay, if I am learning something and my father will get to know about this output immediately, I finish this. He will be on toes. His concentration levels will be very high. And now let me show you, Girish. Let's start showing the step app. Just see this. This is a homework app that we are using for our students, and this is in addition to the pedagogy that we already have in place. And I'll show you how it is revolutionary, how it is going to help you. And uh, your feedback will tell me after you've seen the app. Your feedback. So go to any physics chapter. I am a physics teacher. I would like to show you a physics chapter. This is a chapter on human eye. So let's see. this human eye chapter we have broken down this thing into small small islands where the child will keep learning and progressing structure of human eye part 1 let's see how the child will be learning doing his homework on this welcome dear students now 
we will learn about structure of the human eye. Appearance The human eyeball is approximately spherical in shape with a diameter of about 2.3 cm. Now this is just a 10th standard chapter. So it's not like that challenging like 11th and 12th. Haan, chali. Next. Cornea. Light enters the eye through a thin membrane called the cornea. It forms the transparent bulge on the front surface of the eyeball. A child remembers a movie very easily. A three hour movie. You ask him a question six months later, he will be able to answer without any memorizing, without any preparation for an exam on the movie. This visualization of every concept is also ensured. Next. Refraction through the cornea. Most of the refraction of the light rays entering the eye occurs at the cornea's outer surface. Fourth concept. Iris and pupil. Iris is a dark muscular diaphragm behind the cornea that controls the size of the pupil. The pupil regulates and controls the amount of light entering the eye. When the child has learned these four concepts, now the child will, uh, if you give a video lecture to a child, the ch and you ask the child, have you learned it? He will, any child invariably says, yes, I've learned everything. I've seen it. You, your child is studying in pace. You ask him after six months, uh, after two months, kaisi chal rahi hai padai? Invariably, every child says, ke bahut achi chal rahi hai. I wanted to bring a accountability. I wanted to bring a check there. I wanted to ensure that the parent on a daily basis knows how much his child is learning and what he is learning and where he is weak and strong. Now just have a look. So now he'll answer one question on each concept. And these questions are going to be basic. Abhi. Chali. And this is in a gamified format. The child has to be correct and speed has to be good. So 30 seconds, the timer is on. Human eyeball is approximately spherical in shape. True. True. Cornea forms a transparent bulge on the front surface of the eyeball. That's true. Let's give a wrong answer. Let's see what happens if we give a wrong answer. The moment the child gives a wrong answer, correct solution comes. And he's taken back to the concept on which he has made a mistake. He has the option. If he feels he has made a silly mistake, he can start replaying. If he feels he has not understood it, he'll go back to this concept. Just click on relearn. Cornea. Light enters the eye through a thin membrane called the cornea. It forms the transparent bulge on the front surface of the eyeball. Once the child has relearned the concept, another set of questions, one question on each concept will be asked. The questions will change. The concept will remain the same. Diameter of human eyeball is about 2.8 false. Light enters the eye through a thin membrane called the cornea. True. Majority of the refraction occurs at the cornea. True. True. Girish, it's true. The iris controls the size of the pupil, which regulates the amount of light that enters the eye. Iris controls the size of the pupil. True. Now this time, now you can see out of six questions that the child has answered, five are correct and his performance is 90, his time efficiency is 91%. You can see how time efficiency is being calculated. 30 seconds were allotted to the question, 10 for reading the question, 20 for answering the question and the time that he saves will decide his time efficiency. So now, the mistake that your child made will also be archived and shared with you. And this is the mistake. He answered this question wrong. 
this was the question incorrect answer correct solution he can retest the concept once he retests uh, retest or rela i threw it in uh, true the folder turns green and the child has learned from his mistake also report go back to the report yeah so if the child wants to improvise this score he can do multiple attempts every time a set of questions different set of questions will come and this whole analysis will be shared with the parents so the parent will know uh, now go back now adaptiveness how it adapts when he goes to the next island if you have got 90 above performance in your first island when you go to the next island you will be asked one level tougher questions the learning will remain the same for every child but the nature of questions the toughness of questions will increase if your performance is average toughness of questions will remain the same if your performance is bad it will decrease by one level there are three levels level one two three now this way it will keep adapting to the child and when the child keeps progressing and goes up while learning he will keep learning different different subtopics and when he reaches the second last island which is revise all the mistakes that he made we will throw the program will throw questions on him on those mistakes to ensure whether he has learned that topic properly or not once he has finished the revise section he goes to the treasure chest in the treasure it's like a cumulative test and based on this whole performance the child is earning silver coins which are his learning efficiency coins it ye percentage represent karta hai ki uski learn karte hue how attentive he was how many less mistakes he made and how time efficient he was this time efficiency factor increases in helping us improve the child's speed of answering questions this uh, uh, gold coins that he'll be earning will be his knowledge currency which will be based on his total knowledge that he has earned based on his cumulative test and these two combined will decide his knowledge wealth which is like will decide his leaderboard ranking will decide rewards and uh, scholarships and prizes for the child so i wanted to keep it more interesting i wanted to give the child a tab or a pair. we are in talks with the corporate sector one of my student is uh, a, a, a marketing head of puma shoes uh, banks so we are trying to bring in rewards for the children for studying ke bachcha apni padhai kar raha hai aur pad ke he is able to earn rewards and things which will help him in school academics so uh, this is uh, the game plan the moment he finishes this chapter the child's detailed progress report of the chapter is shared with the parents automatically based on the contact info that the child will be feeding in it the parents who are present here must ensure that when your child is getting access to step for step app he must feed your email id and your mobile number for the feedback that has to go to the parents you have to ensure that it is your number that has to be fed so that you receive it constantly now you can understand when a child is learning and he knows that this feedback will go to my father his attentiveness his sincerity his uh, will go high and if i can make him a little more sincere and this is this innovation is going to be in addition to the existing pedagogy whatever teachers are teaching this is going to be used as a homework app in pace by the students for every chapter that they will be doing this will be like a basic conceptual clarity before they come to the class they should have learned these concepts and then the teachers of pace will make them understand the beauty of the subject our expertise lies in ensuring that the children and the sincerity levels the accountability the moment a parent is getting notification almost every day the moment that and you will have details of a child go to view details you will have the details of your child you will know how many chapters in physics chemistry maths he has finished 
in maths in circles if this is the chapter what is his performance you will know sub topic wise you can see uh, these were the sub topics and this child has done really well in uh, circles chapter he has got a plus grade in every sub topic so you are sure that your child is learning the concepts basics and is being monitored this used to be a very big headache humanly it is not possible to do this manually and only technology could do that and it took us around 10 years to build this innovation and now it has been we have started making it uh, a part of pace pedagogy and uh, uh, next week we are launching the latest version of it which will have every feature every detail very beautiful and you will love it so parents i hope you can understand how important it is ye hata dijiye abhi girish come out of it then the, besides this there are quizzes there are additional study materials there are a lot of things which will be there for the child to challenge his friend and all and this is something which is a very organized way aap homework jo bacche ko de rahe hain besides your booklets and everything else this will ensure that every parent is in the loop and knows that this gamified learning thing that the child has received is your child being sincere about the subject is your child learning the basic concepts properly or not and if there is any slack on behalf of the child you will be immediately bringing it to our attention to my management my management will be working on based on the outputs jo dashboards pe we are also monitoring the children now so on those uh, monitors when i see that so and so child is not doing anything we will be contacting the parents and giving them the feedback that there is a slack there is a delay there is an inefficiency there is a lack of hard work and this will happen in real time basis this is not going to happen after a two month uh, ptm by then the child has got into a wrong company and become insincere so this technology innovation i feel is going to bring the level is going to raise the bar i would like to know the feedback of the parents because this in the chat box you can write how many of you like it acha this is not about scholarship please uh, parents don't ask this question ye to main aapko apni jo innovation hai iske basis pe uh, how we will change the pedagogy how we will uh, uh make uh, learning more fun and more accountable for the child uh, this is an addition ha huh. to those parents who do not want this that's okay i do not want to force anyone on this this is like a one hour a week kind of thing which he has to dedicate and those who are not very keen that's perfectly fine okay now there are a lot of other questions that i can see integrated program or a normal school course which is better uh obviously it is the integrated approach that is the reason 2010 when i started my own junior science class colleges uh the toppers of the city like the highest cut off 100 year old colleges which were reputed their hollowness got evident on the first year itself we had the highest cut off and that highest cut off was because in pace we ensure that the child is not doing anything pseudo the child is not wasting any time any uh, doing anything ke journals likh raha hai aur use samajh mein kuch aaya nahi hai aur practicals mein kuch aur chal raha hai school ke college ke exams mein kuch aur chal raha hai iit ki preparation mein something else is going on so this whole <clears throat> one umbrella approach is what helps the children so without any doubt integrated approach is the approach that you yes this app is a part of our pedagogy and it is free for our students good innovation content will be the key yes the content has been made by my 400 itians and you will see the level up that will you will see and the accountability and the thank you shikha a uh, good app can multiple numbers and email no multiple numbers not only one email id and one number a uh, nice app does the app have only pcm subjects yes physics chemistry maths biology and vocational subjects like computer science and english are not there right now 
what is the time demand? Uh, this app is just a homework app this is in addition to what pace is doing everything else remains the same this is to ensure that the child learns basic concepts and every parent is in the loop he's monitoring his child he's aware wo jo ek totally unaware approach hoti thi here the parents in fact that parental motivation the emotional motivation that i was talking about is being used here because the child wants to be a hero in the eyes of the parents the child will pay attention will play and learn sincerely and this is like a very uh, uh, small component of learning this is a very like uh, one hour a week for each subject is to be devoted for this nothing more than that no you don't have to pay for this app right now we are providing it to our students for free again parents are worried about the package no this app is for free please do not write this again and again okay yes we have it for different boards we have separately for icsc we have separately for cbsc what are the rewards the rewards are right now being worked on no child school learning will be missed out right this will help your child in strengthening his concepts and bring in a lot of transparency and accountability it is free this will jo the state board students specially will get more help from this app because their basic concepts will get strengthened should we opt for pace andheri or i am i have started answering questions now uh pace andheri or integrated at podar you can choose any of the two in pace andheri we have pace junior science college and uh, uh, in in podar you have school plus uh, pace program so whatever you feel more comfortable is closer to your place is preferable and uh, which board is better okay there is a question in the mind of parents let me share something with you on these lines many parents ask me this question in many seminars which board is a better board so the chief secretary present manush shrivastav his daughter was in 11th in a cbsc school nivinagar and had joined some other coaching classes had stopped preparing for iit and this is a period when he met me so mr kunte the ex municipal commissioner of maharashtra his son had got selected in iit and there was a party where he met me and he shared his daughter's story and he asked me if i can be of help he brought his daughter to our office i interacted with her for half an hour i understood that the child has the potential i told them you shift her from that cbsc school to my integrated program in kc college he was very shocked most of the parents carry this notion that this board cbsc board has an edge over uh, hsc or any other board at first thing is you people need to be aware objectively hsc maharashtra government did a very smart thing around 10 years back and you can verify it from any senior any child who's passed out 11 12 from hsc you will be sure uh, to get it verified that hsc mapped its syllabus exactly to cbsc so there is no difference between in 11th and 12th i'm not talking about junior classes in 11th and 12th S H S C syllabus and C B S C syllabus is exactly identical. That is one. So that board differentiation or board advantage goes away. But at the same time, again, I would like to say that it is not the board syllabus what matters. It is the teachers who teach your child. It is the conceptual clarity that your child gains while he is preparing for competitive exams, which is the most important thing. So. Uh, uh moving ahead with the questions yes medical we have produced 24th rank this year uh yes these topics will be totally related to the topics going on in their classes 
uh, if I have uh, 12 centers in Bombay and I have one teacher in maths, can that one teacher go to 12 centers and teach Manish Kumar? Obviously not. We have around 500 teachers who are IITians and who are equally reputed and they all are rotating across all our centers and you go to any of my center and you will get take feedback from the students and you'll hear great things about the faculty. So our faculty is our biggest strength and I can assure you we have the best of the teachers in the country. Uh, whether topic covered are with JE syllabus, yes, in 11, 12 they are. This is same as faculty should be monitoring. Yes, faculty will also be monitoring. I told you pace pedagogy remains the same. This is in addition to that. The app will be doing an additional contribution to the success of the child. This is a brilliant addition. Thank you very much. There are some parents who are understanding what I have shared. Thank you. Can we opt without college? Yes, you can, but that's a very risky proposition. I will strongly advise you that you should join both, uh, whether you join PACE or you join somewhere else, but you should not be traveling to two different locations and wasting your time and then wasting your effort also in a college where quality teachers are not there. So strong advice to you, Piyush uh, Purushottam. Parental responsibility sirf itni hai ke parent loop mein rehne chahiye. When I am saying that this app will send you a, a detailed analysis of your child and when you come home and you already know this is going on, so spending five minutes with your child asking about his studies and if he needs any help or you need to coordinate anything, that kind of awareness. It should not be like for six months you don't ask your child what he is doing or not doing. So little involvement, participation is needed. All our colleges have that integrated program. It would be easy for us to access. Yes, it will be provided to you. If you go to the Play Store, it is downloadable for 5000 rupees. But when you are a part of my system, you will get it for free. We have implemented in our more than 5000 schools across the country. Kendriya Vidyalayas, Jawahar Navodya Vidyalayas, Eklavya schools. We have also implemented it in recently modern school, Barakhamba Road, DPSs, DAVs, many, many lots of them. So you will, you will see how interesting your children will find it and how helpful it will be with time. Oh yeah, so there is a very relevant question which has come. So many parents want to know if my child will be able to do IIT or not. Yes. So we conduct an ACE of PACE exam, which is like a litmus test for, we also want to be sure. So PACE has been very selective about choosing the students. PACE ensures that we do not want to encourage, if a child is not capable, I do not want to invest my two years and energy into that child. If the child has the potential and ability, only then we will allow him into our system. And that's what I, and we are little liberal. I'm not saying that we are very rigid about it because I know the capability of a child. If a child decides to do something, he can be, a, I was a 60 percenter turned IATN. So I know the capability of a child, but more or less we want to be like really sure and our ace of pace exam will do that needful that you want to know and uh, besides that the efforts it's a long race iit preparation is a two year process the consistency the sincerity of the child votes are both important that plays a very very important role in fact more important role than the sheer intelligence of a child so uh, answering the, that on day one uh, can be done by an astrologer better than uh, a science, science person like me but one thing I can say is we select meritorious kids and in fact the first tests which we exams now started, these tests attract the best of the students of Bombay. Like you will find when you will go and give an exam at any of our centers, you will find 
rank one two three types of every school because these sincere students are the students who start who are aware and who start moving and giving pace exam and want to join it early and then these kind of students when they are put together in a batch they add value to each other so i can assure you that this uh, whole process of selection through ace of pace and then the batch formation and putting them with the best brains together and then providing them the quality teachers this is like a foolproof process and you will uh, i'm sure you will see that uh, advantage emotional motivation very powerful driver thank you so much yes so once manoj ganjawala uh, once you are able to identify the weaknesses of the child then my teachers will personally work on those children based on their strengths and weaknesses the parents will be able to approach my teachers with the needs that the child has but that transparent mechanism was needed and we have brought that through this innovation October second scholarship exam scores for mains also. ये सब चीजें प्रीति मैम वेल आंसर. All these scholarships and tests and cut off percentage. All of you have given an exam, uh, two exams, and I know a uh, lot of anxiety about the results and scholarships and everything is there. I will request प्रीति मैम to come in between and answer this. Uh, one minute. I'll let me just see. We if we choose Podar Pace combination. uh will the same professors and aneri and training center yes i can assure you best quality teachers at both the places will be provided rest details you take from priti ma'am i am not the right person to answer such nitty gritty detailed questions um okay priti ma'am i think now the questions are more specific so i will leave you thank you sir so parents today's test results will be declared uh... tomorrow evening 5 pm they will be live on our website also available at our centers the contact details are also mentioned in the hall ticket of the candidate so you can also personally reach out to us on the landline or view the result on the website iitnspace.com we are open from morning 8 to evening 9 at the center we would like to in person meet you understand and also guide you with your queries uh one session alone might not be enough to answer every question that is here so i think an in person meeting would be advisable where we can guide you understanding the child's background school performance various competitive exams and the ace of pace performance together will be the right way for us to take this uh, discussion for the child ahead the next scholarship students in case there is somebody here who's not been able to take the test today the next date is going to be 30th of october team if there are any other questions for me please do let me know nipa ma'am also wanted to share something as a parent uh, Ipa ma'am, if you are there and if you would like to, please do that. So Nipa Shah ma'am is one of our parent, ex-parent who heads our Dadar Center, and her son was a gold medalist in India in international physics Olympiad, and uh, Kunal was there in two thousand eight. Eight. Twenty fourth rank in India in IIT. Right. Please continue, Nipa ma'am. Yeah. Thank you, sir. Thank you for. giving me the opportunity hi parents good afternoon to all of you uh, there is nothing much to say uh, you all have heard a very strong visionary inspire inspiring person as mr pravin tyagi who has been a finest teacher uh, my son was lucky to have him as a teacher when he was studying at pace i as parent have actually you know have seen the journey with pace as parent as well as now i am doing as an administrator at dadar and i can tell you i have enjoyed both the journeys very well very fruitful journeys for me in terms of my son achieving amazing results through guidance of tyagi sir constantly 
and now at the other center where also i hope that i am producing good results year after year giving good uh, students to uh, pace uh, by motivating them by pushing them hard whatever best i can do for them as a parent tyagi sir has always been a great visionary i personally feel i have always got so much of in inspiration from him and that was one of the main reason that pace actually got success from the beginning from the very first year he had a strong vision and he has put everything that he thought of accordingly and he got best of the students best of the teachers best material everything that is required for a student to get the success everything has been provided by him without any hesitations and that is the reason that pace has has been a legacy not just of a year or two a year of 25 years year after year we have been able to produce i think toppers in every domain it's the pace is a one step solution for any child who's pursuing science because we have competitive exams we have best colleges uh, uh, we have even in education abroad program wherein we have so many students also exploring top most universities across the globe including mit stanford carnegie mellon princeton columbia you name the universities where our kids have not gone so i think for any child who really wants to dream big pace is the best solution that's what i had to say thank you sir thank you Thank, thank you, Nipa. Thank you, Nipa, ma'am. So I think what Nipa, ma'am, said: if you put heart, heart and soul in what you like to do, you're sure to achieve your dreams. You're sure to achieve the success, and that is what Tiagi sir has done in his life. And uh, his wealth, his legacy is, of course, the students who are so well placed across the globe. And uh, this is what we cherish together uh, at Pace. So. in the end i would like to thank all the parents who attended today's webinar heard us so patiently thank you nipa ma'am for being so generous with your kind words and uh, for all the parents i would like to say that for me it's a very big thing when you place the future of your child in so our hands uh it's a very big responsibility and uh, i can assure you we will do justice to you more than that thank you so much thanks a lot thank you sir thank you parents for giving us your time on a sunday afternoon i know there are more questions as mentioned we look forward to have you at our center and have you on board to help you help your child reach what you deserve, what you look forward to thank you everyone thank you team for hosting this webinar thank you parents